Good day, everyone. Welcome to Science for Young Minds with Marvit Education Center. This series is for Patom 4. Let's learn some vocabulary words. All right. You will learn how to spell and pronounce some vocabulary words. Here are some important words for this lesson. Can you say them with me? Here we go. One, flower. Two, pistol. Three, pollen. Four, pollination. Five, fruit. Please say the words by yourself. That was awesome. Let's learn more about each word. Are you ready? Please say the word with me. Flower. Let's say it again. Flower. F. L. O. W. E. R. Flower. That was fantastic. Can you say the word by yourself? Excellent. The flowers produce fruits and seeds. Some flowers are small and some are big. Can you read a sentence on your own? Wonderful. Let's learn another one. Please say the word with me. Pistol. Let's say it again. Pistol. P. I. S. T. I. L. Pistol. That was awesome. Can you say the word by yourself? Fantastic! Pistol is the female reproductive part. It has four parts. Stigma, style, ovary, and ovule. Can you read a sentence on your own? Great! Let's learn another one. Please say the word with me. Pollen. Let's say it again. Pollen. E. O. L. L. E. N. Pollen. That was incredible. Can you say the word by yourself? The pollen grains contain male gametes. Can you read a sentence on your own? Amazing! Let's learn another one. Please say the word with me. Pollination. Let's say it again. Pollination. P O L L I N A T I O N. 
pollination. That was great. Can you say the word by yourself? Excellent. Pollination is caused by honeybees or wind. Can you read a sentence on your own? Amazing! Let's learn another one. Please say the word with me. Fruit. Let's say it again. Fruit. F. R. U. I. T. Fruit. That was very good. Can you say the word by yourself? Well done! Tomatoes and apples are fruits. Can you read a sentence on your own? Amazing! In this lesson, you will learn how to identify flowering plants, name some parts of a flower, and understand the process of pollination. Do you know what are flowering plants? Great! Flowering plants are plants that produce flowers. Flowers are usually used to decorate and to make a place beautiful to look at. But do you know that flowers are very important for another reason? Yes. Flowering plant produces fruits and seeds through its flowers. How does this happen? Let's find out. Flower is the colorful and attractive part of the plant. Do you know that flowers have reproductive parts too? Do you know what we call the reproductive parts of a flower? Clever! Stamen is the male reproductive part, while pistol is the female reproductive part. Do you have any idea how plants reproduce? When the pollens from the stamen gets into the pistol, down into the ovary, and fertilization happens, the ovary becomes bigger and it will eventually become a blank. Excellent! Fruit. Do you like to eat fruits? Fruits are part of a plant that have seeds. The fruits came from the fertilization of the plants that happened inside the ovary of the flower. I have a trivia for you. Not all flowering plants bear fruit, but all fruit bearing plants are flowering plants. Do you understand? Another trivia is this. Not all fruits are sweet and edible. Do you know some fruits that are edible? Can you name them? Amazing! Plants reproduce through pollination. Pollination is the act of transferring of pollen grains. Pollination can be caused by animals, most commonly insects. One of the most common insects are the honeybees. They carry pollens on their legs and wings as they fly from one flower to another to gather honey. 
The second cause of pollination is the wind. The pollens of the flowers are being carried by the wind as it blows to different directions. Please answer the activity worksheet, science set number five. Thank you for your attention and see you in the next episode.